Today, I want to talk to you about the Mission Gold Paints from Korea. During the last video, I showed you the box when it arrived, the unboxing, and how I put the paints into a plastic palette made by Alvin. The problem that I had is that that plastic palette only held 24 colors. It only had 24 wells. And my Mission Gold set brought 36 paints. So I decided to buy a metal box palette. But then again, I had another problem, is that the insert in that palette can only hold 24 to 28 full pans. So what I had to do was to replace the insert with one that I made of plastic. I was actually able to fit 35 full pans glued to the plastic insert. This is now the palette that I have with the most full pan colors. I used to have the White Knight 36 pan set but I gave it away to a student friend. I said 36 colors, but I only got 35 pans that I was able to put in the insert. But then again, I never used black paint for my watercolors. I also replaced the Chinese white that came with the set and decided to use white wash instead. I think the gouache that I used is by Windsor Newton. It is always a good idea to make a color chart that you can use as future reference. It can tell you how opaque each pigment is. The Mission Gold Korean paints were a wonderful surprise. Comparable to the surprise I got when I bought my White Knight Russian watercolor. It seems like the Asian paints are really and truly professional quality paints and they come at a fraction of the cost of the European and American counterparts. That is perhaps why people think they may be student grade, but they are truly professional quality. Even the package of these Mission Gold paints bears witness to the quality of the paints themselves. Have fun creating your own palettes.